Another former Liberty University football player has filed a hundred million dollar lawsuit against the school and their accuser. Former players Kyle Carrington and Avery James are suing for defamation. This comes after a federal judge in Lynchburg approved Cameron Jackson's claims to move forward for a jury trial. They claim the investigation was handled unfairly and ruined their reputations. WSLS 10's Magdala Lusant has more on this developing story. In July 2016, a female Liberty University student came forward and said several LU football players sexually assaulted her months earlier. Two of the players accused, Avery James and Kyle Carrington, claimed they had engaged in consensual sex with the woman. In separate lawsuits, they are suing both her and the university. They claim the investigation was handled unfairly, and the university ruined their reputation by releasing their names in a press release saying they were suspended for sexual assault. In a 90-page document, Kyle Carrington says his academic future, career in athletics, and his reputation and good name have been irreparably damaged. In the complaint, Carrington says he met the woman at a house party in August 2015, where she voluntarily performed sexual acts for him and other their football players. In the fall semester, rumors surfaced on campus that a woman had been gang raped by the football team. According to the complaint, the university investigated the rumors and questioned the female student. In the lawsuit, the woman was set to meet with student conduct personnel and asked a friend for advice, saying, quote, do you think I should say I was raped? Shortly after, the woman told school officials via email that no non-consensual sex occurred on the night of the incident. Eleven months later, documents say the woman contacted the school, claiming the incident was not consensual. It goes on to say her account of the incident changed multiple times. She first claimed to have been raped by as many as eight, then six members of the football team. The document says in the final story, the woman claimed she was sexually assaulted by three men, Kyle Carrington, Cameron Jackson, and Avery James. The former players were never charged. In Lynchburg, Magdala Lusant, WSLS 10.